We interrupt this new program with some breaking news. Just now we received a report about the erupting at Mount Fuji. Now let's go to Val, who is on the scene. Thank you, Suji. Well, so right now I'm here in Kyubu region in Honsu, Japan. Behind me is the tallest mountain in Japan, Mount Fuji. Next to me is one of the witnesses who was there at the time to see. Hi, so can you tell us your name? Um, do I have to? Please? <laughs> Uh, um, e Emily S Sky. Okay, Emily, so can you explain to us what happened during the eruption? Well, it exploded. Can you tell us a bit more details? Um, <clears throat> well, I was sitting on my front porch, which is just across the lake. I was having my afternoon snack consi consisting of milk and cookies. Just then, I heard a view, big, humongous, gigantic, monstrous, kaboom! Then what happened? Then, it was raining cinders and ashes. It might have been boy toys. Cool. Now, back to you, Suji. Thanks, Val, for that wonderful interview. Now we have Val again with Dr. Num Num in the Japan Institute of Volcanic Eruptions with some facts about this eruption. Thank you, Suji. As you know, this volcano is currently, erupt is currently active, but it's active with a low risk of eruption. So what type of volcano is Mount Fuji? This type of volcano is a stratovolcano. This type of volcano is made up of explosive eruptions from ash and cinder. Can you explain how this eruption happened? Well, according to scientists, Mount Fuji is located on the convergence of Asian Plate, aka Eurasian, and Pacific Plate. A convergent boundary creates an explosive eruption when the oceanic plate subducts under the continental plate. Wow, now that is a lot of facts about the volcano. There was a lot of fancy words in there, too. I wonder how scientists stuff all that stuff up. Now back to you, Suji. Thank you, Dr. Num Num, for that explanation. Now it's nearly the end of this news story. Sorry to take up your time, and remember to watch ASEAN News at 7 o'clock on Channel 10. Again, this has been Breaking News with the ASEAN Station. Thank you. This was the news brought to you by Megan, Michelle, Michelle, and Jisoo. <laughs>
mountains have been destroyed by the lava and debris. Hugo Peterson, anything new to report? Uh, not really, guys. Stan? Crazy, man. Crazy. Back to you guys. Well, that's all for this special news report, ladies and gentlemen. We now return to the hit show, The Simpsons, already in progress. The preceding program is the property of OMG Networks and cannot be rebroadcast or retransmitted without the express written consent of OMG. OMG! <laughs> <laughs> this was the news brought to you by Darian, Max, Thomas, Ray, and Gideon. <laughs>
This was the news brought to you by Brianna, B, Toktoon, Leah, and Alice. Here we are in ABC News, Channel 7 at 7 o'clock. Time for the weather report. Marlin? It's weird, there's a big storm coming to Albany. What a quick. It is going to be about hot and sunny. The temperature of the was 78 degrees Fahrenheit. And Oakland is having a very well. <laughs> over, over in the ice cold arena, it's 30 degrees Fahrenheit. It is snowing very practically. Thank you for the weather report. Now let's check on Mr. Doodle finding his bird. I haven't found my bird yet. I still have hope on finding it. Luckily, <laughs> luckily, me, uh, Mr. Doodle has not given up yet. We interrupt this program for breaking news. Mountain, Mountain Palace has just erupted recently. I'm here at the scene with our witness, Franklin. And now I'm going to ask him about um, what happened at the eruption. Franklin? Franklin! Oh, I'm um, sorry. I was just playing my leads, playing some bowling, you know? Then when all suddenly the earth started shaking, I thought it was an earthquake, so I ran outside and I looked around. But it was actually Mount St. Helens erupting. I, there were molten pieces of rock falling down on us. I tried to run from it, but I burnt my shoes. The shoes cost me $100. <laughs> Even so, I'm lucky to be alive. Okay, now let's go over to Professor Wilson's laboratory. Okay, Professor Wilson, what kind of eruption was it? There was a plenty of eruption, one of the most deadly eruptions there are. How tall was Mount St. Helens before the eruption, and how tall is it now? Mount St. Helens Mount St. Helens was about 10,000 feet tall, but now it's only about 8,400 feet tall. Do you think Mount St. Helens is still going to be active in the future? Uh, yes, I'm almost 100% sure of it. Where did this occur? This occurred in Washington at 5.18 a.m. 200 people lost their homes. 11 million fish were killed. 5,000 deer died. 85 miles of the highways were destroyed. And luckily, only 57 people died in the blast. The eruption had the power of 27 atomic bombs. It will be more, even more destructive for kingdoms in the future. Wow, that's amazing. Now that's the end of our show, ABC News. This was the news brought to you by Carrie, Marlon, <laughs> Jethro, and Sunny, 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 and a slight chance of sun. It seems like it might be one of the hottest days of the year, ranging from the mid-90s to the low 80s in some places. Might be even hot enough for a volcano to erupt. <laughs> 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 or you could just take your kids to the beach or relax by the pool, because it's a hot November day out there, folks. Oh, um, we're going to go back to you, Chuck, with some interesting news. Thank you for that retro weather report, William. This is Nose Witness News on Channel... One, two, three, four, five, twelve. Brought to you by McDonald's. I'm Chuck Taylor, and this is the 613 News. Oh, yes, breaking news, people. I've just been informed that the Edna volcano in Sicily, Italy has erupted once again. It has been spitting out lava for, for a few days now, with mostly lava flowing out of the north, south, and west craters. We can tell that its magma chamber was just waiting to get that lava out. We have Ashley on the side with the full story. How's it out there, Ashley? Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's lava coming down as the story comes up. Ha 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 ha! That's real um, real funny, Ashley. Real <clears throat> funny. Hey, Dad, Dad, can you can you come over and help me with my homework at home, Dad? Um, Ethan, son, can't you see him in the mirror or something? Maybe we could just go to the beach. Or play some baseball. Because it's so hot out there. Did you hear the weatherman? It's in the mid-90s. The mid-90s. Uh, Ethan, hello? <laughs> oh, <okay>. <laughs> 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 Kids. Uh, Chuck, are you done with that? <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, sorry. Carry on.
on. Thank you. So, this isn't the first time the volcano has erupted. And you can see it's an active volcano. It has been erupting since 1500 BCE, to be exact. And did I mention? It's erupted over 600 times since then. It's the world's most active volcano and the largest in Europe. Its base, which is 600 miles long, stretches across most of the city and stands over 10,991 10, feet high. Whoa. We have our very own news reporter, Sarah, down at the actual base of the volcano, interviewing locals. Sarah? Hey, Ashley, so I have a little boy I witnessed who also lives very nearby the volcano. Could you tell us your name, little boy? Alvin. So, tell us about what you see here. Okay, well, I was walking down the street with my ball, and I was looking for someone to play with. And then I heard a big boom, and I got scared. And I wanted my mom, but I couldn't find her. And thank you, Alvin. You're welcome, I guess. Now, let's find another person down here. Um, here's a long, young lady. What's your name? Um, it's Christy. What's it to you? Could you tell us about the scene you see here? So, I was like buying these super cute you know, shows at the mall with all my friends. And like, I look outside the window and I see all the smoke and I'm all baby cute. Let's go get our super cute bikinis and wear them to the barbecue. Oh uh, my god. And my mom's all like, you're stupid, Christy. And I'm all, I'm breaking up with you. And I'm like walking and I'm here. And I'm, wait, is that a camera? Did I just explain my whole social life on camera? Ugh! by Michaela, Katie, Maria, Danielle, and Colleen or Chuck? <laughs>